Hello beautiful people. Welcome to another video journal for me. Thank you for coming back to my channel, for checking this out, seeing where I'm at. How are y'all doing today? Hopefully well. Uh, today, I am up late again. I'm like whispering because my sister is home now. I'm up late again. It's almost 1 a.m., which is no bueno because I get up to go to CrossFit in like five hours. But it was a pretty good day. I babysat in the morning, spent the morning outside with one of my favorite kids, and then I had drinks this afternoon, like good dinner drinks with some of my new coworkers. That was really fun. It was so fun to connect and talk about all the stuff that we always talk about at work, but we had more time. Um, and I took that job to make new friends, so this just feels really good and exciting to make adult friends of my own. It's hard to make friends as an adult. I think everybody is on the same page about that. Also, my sister is back now. She was traveling for a week or so, so it's really good to have her. We just hung out in here and she was swiping through the dating apps for me, trying to find someone new. Um, she was great. She decided also that it's a hard game to play, but she's just so funny. She gives me life. Um, I asked her to be in this video and she said no, so. <laughs> She's just outside the door. <laughs> Maybe I'll convince her to be in one soon. Um, oh, okay. So, I've been getting some comments. I know, like, these videos are a few days behind, but I've been getting some comments about, like, my dating style right now, and I just want to clarify. I have been dating quite a lot since October. I started dating right away, just a couple weeks after um, my split with my ex, and it was really... Um, empowering to do that and yeah it's been a great time it's all been very casual I've been very upfront with all the people that I've dated that I don't want anything committed don't want anything exclusive that I'm focusing on myself and learning about myself and one of the ways I'm doing that is by meeting new people um, learning what I like who I like what I like to do and learning new things so it's been really fun, and I have been dating multiple people at the same time, which maybe was a little bit confusing um, if you haven't been following my journey so far or didn't know that. Um, but the guy that I was seeing for three months, that was like the most serious thing that I have had yet. Um, and it was almost to the point of becoming exclusive, but then it wasn't, so um, that's fine too. But when I went into that relationship, like, that's what I said. I was like, I don't want anything um, committed, exclusive, just out of this relationship. And I'm focusing on myself for a while, like, at least a year. And so it was, it was me going into it that um, set that boundary. And that's another reason why it was perfectly fine that he met someone that he wanted to have a serious relationship with. So... I'm glad that we were able to communicate that, and I'm also glad that I was able to hold to the boundary that I set for myself, because I know that I still have a lot of learning left to do, I'm learning new things about myself every day, and I love that for me. I'm definitely not ready to commit to one person at this time, unless that one person is myself, which in that case I'm doing a great job. Um, yeah, so now, if you're interested, I'm not dating anyone. <laughs> There's like one or two people from my past that I'm talking to, but they, I'm not, I'm not dating anyone. So I am actually struggling with that a bit because this is the first time I think that's happened, um, that I don't have anyone really to talk to. Um, and what do I want to say about that? Oh, just that I guess I don't know where to meet people. I'm going to try and figure that out now that my sister is here. And we're going to go into the city, maybe. And I don't know. We'll figure out how one does it. Just walking around, going to bars. I'm not, I'm not drinking right now, but uh, maybe just going to parks. <laughs> I'm clueless, but she's not. So I'm going to follow her lead and we'll go from there. But yeah. I like talking about those things, and that's a lot of what occupies my mind, but I'm also doing other things. I'm doing photography, I'm babysitting, I have these new friends, new co-workers, I'm working at the cafe a couple days a week. 
I have family that I talk to and other things going on in my life, but dating has been at the forefront recently. It's the most interesting for me right now and it's the most fun most of the time. Um, and it's just like the most new, you know, I wasn't dating anyone else. This is my first time dating in my adult life, so there's a lot of new and it's exciting. And I like it. So, yeah. Also, I'm not telling people about this YouTube channel, so unless men are doing like a deep search on me, they're not gonna find this. And if they do, then props to them for finding it. Um, I don't say anything that I would regret other people hearing, so that's fine with me too. It's just a little bit of an overshare. <laughs> but it's my thing, so whatever. Hope y'all are doing well. I'm gonna get to bed because I'm going to the gym so soon. Have another long day tomorrow and then another long day the following day. So I need some sleep. Um, let me know your questions. If you have anything you would like me to talk about, I'd be happy to in the upcoming video. Um, yeah, just a little rant for the day. So, anything else? I had a burger for dinner tonight. It was great. My skin is feeling okay. And... Hmm. Anything else? I'm still behind on my editing. That's causing me stress. But my new coworker and friend Colleen says that if I finish this one project I was telling her about in a week that she's gonna buy me a dozen donuts. So now I have accountability and the motivation of donuts to help me get through that. She's really cool. Have a good day, guys. I will see you all later. Love to you all. <laughs> Bye.